Welcome to the Shikama Live Show with your host, Shikama. I'm, I'm not going to get emotional. Uh, to all of the fathers out there, I want to wish you a happy Father's Day. Uh, I wanted to talk about a, a segment of the population uh, that are in my situation, where uh, my father passed away when I was very young. I was very young, and uh, I wanted to say uh, that uh, so then I missed having a dad who uh, was not there when I went to first started school, first started, yeah, first started school, he was there when I was walking, I was going to say when I first started walking, but when I first, uh, not first started school, but uh Maybe middle school, high school, see my middle school graduation, uh, high school graduation, college graduation. Uh, do you know my mother did not come to my college to graduation at all? Not even not even a little bit. Uh, and when uh, I asked her about it, she said, I didn't know. Uh, she does a lot of that uh, I don't know, and she does a lot of... Uh, she doesn't want to be around and she doesn't want to uh, she doesn't want to partake in I guess my life so <laughs> so uh, she wasn't around for a lot of things so then that makes me uh, miss my father even more because so I don't have uh, somebody else to turn to to say this person is not acting like a parent you know I mean, uh, if you don't, if your own mother doesn't uh, show up to any graduation, uh, yeah, uh, my high school graduation, uh, literally my aunt came and picked me up, dropped me off and picked me up. Uh, uh, I, I don't even, I guess I had a robe, I don't, I don't remember, uh, for my college graduation because nobody was coming. I actually ushered at my college graduation. They read my name off on stage, and and that was it. Uh, so there was no reason to go across the stage because nobody was there to cheer me on or do anything. So it, it was for me. It wasn't a it wasn't a great day. Uh, and there was a lot of that in my life, and uh, I lament that uh, my father wasn't. And it's not his fault. Of course, I'm not blaming him. I'm just saying. I missed all of that and I want to stress to a lot of women how important a father is especially in a young man's life especially in a young man's life uh, if you can assume that it's important in a young lady's life that she have a, a dad in her life and that he he teaches her how she is supposed to treat men which is not something that a woman can do to a daughter uh, and how men are supposed to treat her which is again not something that a woman can do to a daughter how double and triple and quadruply important is it that then a father be in a young man's life so for all of you women who do this I uh, literally I live next to a uh, door to some young men with uh, babies mamas and so forth and so on and i see it firsthand you know uh, uh, them at, at any point she tries to keep uh, his son away from him uh and uh that and of course that's heartbreaking to me and i'm not even their real friends and so but on this father's day i do want to i want to stress just how important fathers are and I want to, uh, for all of us whose fathers passed away when we were children, I, I want to dedicate this Father Day to all of you all who are in the same boat with me uh, that uh, who never really grew up uh, with their dad, and, and it's tragic. Now I want to then say to all of the people whose father passed away, uh, and then the, the mother remarried and that you did grow up with a father a stepdad or something like that and he did 
he was there for your middle school grade. He was there for your middle school graduation and your high school graduation. And, uh, and I want you to uh, give him a big hug for me to say that, uh, to say thank you and happy Father's Day. So thank you all for watching. Leave a like.